fresh and fit what has it been said about these guys a few days ago we took a look at how one of the guys fresh if you will <laughs> sorry i can't get over the names are so stupid <laughs> this sounds like a fake disney channel superhero name just because they couldn't use superman and batman they were like ah, fresh and fit so a few days ago we talked about these two goofballs and ever since my last video on them i've been curious i've been keeping my eyes on fresh and fit don't trust these clowns or anyone similar they don't even follow their own damn advice and it doesn't seem like their content is stopping anytime soon just flying hoes from miami paying them to be on their show so no change no responsibility no accountability just moving on ghetto girls fight about georgia versus florida just a banger that one cannot miss please don't ever listen to people like this they're the biggest liars and hypocrites you would ever come across and the things that they criticize and are against they're the same things they're doing so a few days ago Avon preach made this video where fresh and fit more specifically fit in this situation has some mental breakdown <laughs> fresh and fit were the ones calling ava and preach sussy weird gay homosexuals because they like to dance so this is just elementary school insults you're gay no you're gayer because you danced no you're gayer because there's pictures of you cuddling with a man it's funny and i've never seen a self-claimed alpha male being this triggered over being called gay <laughs> oh yeah he called the, he called me and you bunch of sodomites a bunch of time and they played a clip of you dancing yeah that's me g Wait, who's Mean Gene? Uh, mean Gene is um is a character that I have when I dance whacking. Whacking? Yeah. Okay, go on. I used to dance whacking. I don't dance anymore. No? No. You make money moves? Yeah, man, I was, I was also teaching that dance. So yeah, they saw this and they were calling you a sodomite, a bunch. That's fine. And they got me over here. And you're gay because you dance south? Oh my god. To me, it's crazy to see people like Fresh and Fit calling these guys gays because they like to dance or they're getting paid to teach to dance like what's wrong with that like don't get me wrong it's a funny insult you're gay because you dance you know i don't take it seriously and i don't think anyone should be taking that insult seriously it's elementary school i'm actually curious how old is fresh and fit so fresh is 29 years old i thought he was like 45 and fit is 34 years old we got 30 year old men out here saying you're gay because you dance salsa it's like you should be the last person calling anyone gay when pictures like this exist of you I, I saw andrew tate in the comments being like i'm not surprised they do the most such shit behind closed doors you got myron over here laying in bed with dude grabbing him from behind cuddling but hey yo hey yo what kind of concert is this <laughs> This is the same guy calling other men gay because he danced. This is possibly one of the gayest things you can do. And of course, there's something wrong with being gay. The only reason why I'm making fun of these people, it's because they're the ones that started all of this. You're gay because you dance. And you're gay because of this. This seems like it's a concert. I love going to concerts. I've been to countless concerts over the years. I love it. It's one of my favorite things. It's not my favorite thing to do. And I've never been behind a man or a friend, uh, a male friend, graft him like this. We see Fit right here reaching for the nipple. He's trying to get some action on. Um, you know, I support this, you know. Pretty sussy activity right here. Like, reaching for another man's nipple at a concert. You know, if that's what you're into, more power to you. But, like, but don't go around calling other people gay because they like to dance. And on top of that, they're getting paid to dance. And can we please address this picture? What is the context of this? I have never been in a position like this with any other man in my entire life. See his hands once again reaching for the nipple. I don't know. Does he have a little nipple fetish right there is this the same guy kind of sus but once again if that's what fit is into amen the self-report is crazy and over here laying in bed with dude grabbing him from behind cuddling but that's not gay i've been to a lot of concerts Preach. i ain't never been by one hey, of my homies hey, like hey, yeah, hey, yo hey. yo yeah that's crazy right Calm down, Diddy. I, I, I looked at those pictures Cut and i up. wanted to be open-minded i have literally never been sitting in a like a booth and laid back into <laughs> another man's go the homies out there you know everyone who's watching have you ever been, <laughs> have you ever been with your boys and you're like you know what they just all take a picture like this all three of us this is hella sus a little word of advice you shouldn't go around calling other people gay when pictures of you acting like this exist in my opinion at this point it's gg it's over like you cannot come back from this how do you explain this i don't know is there something you want to tell us Fit? Like it's 2024. Like, you know, if you're gay, no one would care. Now it kind of makes sense why he's always branding himself as this alpha male, the top G, uh, you know, the man's of man's 
Oops, I got a little too excited there. I hit my microphone. And laid back into another man's lap. And while he put his arms around... Hey, let me address this real quick, because people yeah. say that dumb shit. Oh, I saw a gay pictures of you. Bro, those were my teammates. Have you ever played uh, a sport at a high level, military, uh, law enforcement, maybe a uh, comrade? I mean, I played Fortnite, and I'm a pretty good Fortnite player. Like, I never played Fortnite with a friend. I'm like, you know what? Let's just take a picture of us cuddling in bed in the hotel room. Actually, let's bring, let's bring John in. Let's have him sit in the bed as well. <laughs> take a picture. Now, what is this BS about? Have you ever been in the military or any high ranking competitive sport? It's just boys being boys. Nah, the gator is kind of peaking right now. The sooner you come out, the better. It'll be for everyone. People won't make fun of you anymore. I think people will really accept you. I think your whole community would show love. Nah, those pictures are the gayest thing I've seen in a long time. That shit was gayer than gay porn. But you know what? At some point, these fists are gonna chase your fucking face and you're gonna get your shit rocked, you bitch ass motherfucker. You're a bitch and you fucking know it. And no one fucking respects you. That's why I've been on YouTube for 10 fucking years. And if we gotta take this fucking video down YouTube because I'm roasting your dumb ass because I know your audience is gonna sit there and report it for her because you're a fucking pussy, then so fucking be it. You may have 30 plus fucking videos talking shit. Uh, actually, it's 44 videos. But you can't last three minutes in a fucking around with me because you know I'll demolish you. You know I'll you up you know it i'll make you the fucking side of my that you really are you fucking pussy. you fucking know it. i will eat you mother yeah this is how a man a straight man responds to being called gay <laughs> why is brother so triggered he's the one that started the whole thing how many times have i said gay in this video if anyone could count it i'll uh i really appreciate it like they called him gay and now he wants to fight them that doesn't sound like a very secure man that doesn't sound like someone who's comfortable in their own skin now if someone were to make a video on me exposing me being like his videos are very stinky and on top of that sensitive is a big gay he's the queerest guy in the commentary community and he's the gayest person alive i'd be like okay sure you know whatever i wouldn't be like if you ever call me again i'm going to knock you out i'm going to shove my fist up your asshole and beat you up and spit on you and piss on you like and having a full blown out mental breakdown because someone called me gay you know what i mean i'd just be like okay that's fine. I know that I'm not, and I know what I am, and it's not like I'm gonna be like, yo, what the fuck am I? Did another grown man call me gay? Now I gotta question everything. Am I gay? No normal straight man who's secure in their own skin would act like this. Give this guy like seven years until he comes out as gay or something like that, which nothing wrong with, but I called it, and I'm calling it here in this video. But you can't last three minutes in a fuck around with me because you know I'll demolish you. You know I'll fuck you up. You know it. I'll make you the fucking side of my that you really are, you fucking pussy. You got the fucking fear of God in you, man. But it's a pussy. You atheist piece of shit. Your parents don't fucking rock with you. No one respects you. And you fucking know that shit. You piece of fucking shit. Bro, this nigga on earth, man. Oh, yeah. And you fucking know it. If you get the same sexual gratification of dealing with a woman as you're dealing with, do dealing with a guy, human beings are intrinsically lazy creatures. You want to go with the path of least resistance. If you get sexual satisfaction from dudes, and chicks, well, what's easier to get? Dudes. Why the hell are you gonna go through the effort of courting a girl, spending money, having to meet all these prerequisites when you can go in and just smash a guy and be done with it? I know he was making an argument and I know it might be out of context. Yeah, knowing this and knowing how he acted to being called gay, I don't know, I think we should make uh, Fit the mascot of Pride Month. Let's just put his face all over the pride flags. Female vaginas are disgusting. All right, yeah, that's enough. Yeah, this guy's gay. <laughs> <laughs> like, there's, I don't know, there's no denying it at this point. Nothing wrong with gay people, nothing wrong with being gay. But if you're gonna be making fun of someone for dancing and then calling them gay, don't be surprised when people call you gay when you make and say and do some extremely sussy things. Fair game here, dude. If you were to ask me right now, Oscar, what is gayer, dancing and getting some ladies or taking pictures with men at a hotel and then saying that vaginas are disgusting and then saying that you can get the same satisfaction from a dude and it's easier. I'll say the latter is sounds gayer. You know what I mean? Anyways, I love you. Take care. Subscribe or you're gay. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna head out. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out. Bye.